afternoon, everybody. It's Wednesday, May. What's today? Eight. May eight. That's it. We don't have too much to get to the store. We got quite a bit last week. Just a little bit of stuff. We don't have three sides of the grocery list this week. Just one. So we're going to go there. And Brad kept waking me up last night because he told me that he doesn't sleep that well. And I'm like, I don't ever notice him up. Whenever I wake up, he's always asleep. So he said he was going to wake me up every time he woke up. So that... I would know that he's waking up, so he kept waking me up last night. Three different times he woke me up, I think. And I couldn't get no sleep. He kept waking me up. And now you know why I'm always tired, because I can't sleep, because I'm waking up hurting all the time. Because of your feet. My feet, feet my back. And your back. What about your neck? Not yet. I'm okay. sure that's coming. Uh, so, and then he woke me up, Marco, he said, Marco's not getting up, his alarm's going off, and there. what are you doing? You hurt. Pulling my hairs. I need a haircut, that's why my hairs, little hairs are growing out. So, uh. Yeah, so Marco's alarm was going off forever, so I woke him up, and I'm like, this is why he needs to be in bed by 9.30, 10 o'clock, because he doesn't want to get up. And then he doesn't make his bed because he gets doesn't want to get up and he lets the alarm go off forever. And he doesn't eat breakfast because guess what? He did eat rush, breakfast rush, today, rush, though, rush. Because he ate those toaster strudels. Because I woke because him up. Ralphie's like, what happened? Marco ate all the toaster strudels. And was all mad. Because now he liked it. Because anytime the kids, anytime you get something That's for why like, Marco did it. Well, he, uh, he knows and he's afraid of Ralphie's He ate four well, he, toaster he strudels was, this morning. No, he ate some yesterday too. He Fox. ate four. Today. Four? How do you know four? Because Ralphie had one. There was four left. Well, this is a good song. Don't wanna wait till you know me better. Sorry. Just kiss. Um, he had some last night, though. Marco had some last night? After school. Oh, God. <laughs> you want him, Mike? I don't care if you want him. But anyway, once we get, like, Marco right now, stuff that he wants at the list, so Marco thinks. If he wants them, then nobody else can have any of it. I'm like, no. Groceries are for everybody. I even bought, he wanted, oh, double stuffed Oreos, so I got a big uh, family size so that everybody could have some. But it seems like whenever you get one thing for the other kid, the other kid wants some. If you get some for Marco, Ralphie wants some of it. Ralphie's like, why don't I get any beef jerky? I'm like, well, you didn't ask for beef jerky. But then if we get Ralphie something that he wants, then Marco wants what we got for Ralphie. So I said we need to just buy two of everything so they can have one for each other. But then if we want some, then we can sneak in there and get some too. Because we bought it. Well, if we buy two of everything because they want to throw little fits, we're spending more money than we need to spend. And they just need to quit being little jerks. Yeah, they like their food, that's for sure. And you would think they never ever ate because the way they act. And they will, we buy them what they want and it's gone in like two days. And then they're like, what happened? You ate it. There's no... All in a hurry. We have nothing to eat. Like, why do you have to eat it all at once? Like, take your time eating it. Yeah, they do. You know, we don't go to the store for another four days. You ate it the first day we went, so... And if you want anything, you better get it and go yeah. hide it because it's not going to be there very long. Right. With the boys. Yeah. So we take stuff and we hide it in our bedrooms because... <laughs> so we can have some. Otherwise, we're not going to get any. Right. <laughs> So I showed you guys that I started on the railing. So I got this side of the railing done. And then I started on this the other night, this one and this one. And so I got to put one more coat on this and that. And then I have to do this down here. And then I'm gonna do the poles 
And then after I'm done with the poles, I'm gonna paint this wall gray, and then that will be done. And then I'm gonna work on this railing after that. And then after I'm done with this railing, I can do the trim down here on this one, and I can do that and then paint this wall finally because everybody keeps asking, when are we gonna paint that green wall? Well, it's coming. It's just, it takes a minute. <laughs> With the kids doing sports and stuff, and I'm working full-time now, so things have slowed down, and Christmas slowed us down, so it's all coming now. And then I will be doing that down there after I do this. So it's, it's all coming, it's just going slow. Very slow. So a lot of people commented last week on our vlog, they wanted me to do a review of these Ollie Stress gummies that I bought last week. So I've been taking them for, it'll be a week tomorrow. So just about seven days I've been taking them. And honestly, I really don't think I noticed that big of a difference. I've been taking them two gummies every morning. And mm, I mean, sometimes I think maybe I might not feel a stress, but then I kind of do sometimes still. And I don't really feel all that much different, to be honest. I don't know if I would spend 13 to 13.99 on this every month or so Because it's not all that much different. I know I saw some reviews on Facebook where people have these and they're like, oh my gosh I totally noticed a difference so within 15 minutes of taking them and mm, I don't know about that I'm Not sure Brad's been taking them too. Do you notice a difference taking these? Not really the first night I thought I did. You thought you slept better. You said you yeah. slept really good the first night, but not right. anymore. You took them last night and you didn't sleep good, so it didn't work last night? Yeah. So I don't really think I see much of a difference with them at all. Yeah, I don't either. And like I said, the ingredients in there was the, I don't even know how to pronounce these all right, the GABA. It's fast working with 30 to 60 minutes and the L the ant the nine and lemon balm yeah but I don't know we don't really think they're all that much different than what we were before when we take them anyway we might finish this bottle out there's just so many left in here we'll finish it out and then we'll update you in the next few vlogs and let you know how it was by the time we finished this bottle off. Good morning, everybody. It's Thursday morning. I am getting ready to get in the shower. And my hair is a mess. I just woke up. I need to get my hair trimmed because it needs trimmed on the sides and a little bit on the top. So I think Brad, he's out doing some errands. He had to, he had a doctor appointment for his feet because his feet have been hurting, which we, I think we mentioned that yesterday. Uh, and then, um, he's gonna go get some hair stuff for work. And I don't think it goes until three to, or four, three or four today. So I try to go get my hair trimmed before he has his first appointment. Um, and then I think that's about it today. Not really much going on this weekend. Ralphie has baseball practice tonight, but they can't practice on the field again because it's been raining. It keeps raining and then when they have practice, they can't practice on the field. They have to practice on the pavement because the field is all wet and nasty and muddy. So <clears throat> they wear their tennis shoes and practice on the, uh, on the, uh, in the parking lot at the school where they practice at. But they have to practice because they have a game Saturday morning this week. Uh, and then Marco works tonight at four as usual. He usually has, um, he usually works at least Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and sometimes he has Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. This week he only had Monday, Tuesday off, so he worked Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. <clears throat> so he's going to go to work. We have this bird, this red bird keeps flying into our window. If it's not in the front by the front door, it's in the back by the bedroom. I heard him before I woke up. Kept just, oh, watch, there he is. Can you see him? Let me zoom in because I don't want to go close to him because he'll go away if I go close. There he goes. But he keeps running or flying, just flying up to the window and just banging into the window. And he'll keep doing it. 
and keep doing it. I don't know why he's banging into the window. It's like he wants to come inside or something. Does anybody know why a bird would be running into a window? What does that mean? He's not going to do it now. I'll try to get it again later if he, if he does it again. But I'm getting ready to get in the shower right now. Peanut is watching him though. So I just dropped Ralphie off at baseball practice, took Marco to work earlier, came back home and had dinner real quick, then I took Ralphie to baseball practice. And then I stopped by the bank, make a deposit there. Now I'm stopping at Starbucks real quick because they have happy hour today, buy one get one free, so I'm gonna take advantage of that good deal. That only happens like every couple, every two to three weeks or so they have a happy hour on Thursday. If you're a gold card member, you can buy one get one free. So I'm doing that, and when I get to the salon to give Brad one because he's going to trim my hair here, and then I'll go back pick up Ralphie from baseball practice after that, um, and then go home, and then it'll be time for the kids to go to bed. Well, not Marco, because Marco Marco gets up at nine, so I will pick him up, and then he'll get to bed after he gets home. So I got our drinks. I thought it was the um, espresso beverages. Sometimes they have the frappuccinos on happy hour, buy one good free. Sometimes they have this, the espresso beverages. I guess I didn't pull it up and I was gonna get the uh, caramel cloud macchiettos, but it's only on uh, frappuccinos today. So buy one good one free frappuccinos. So um, I was gonna get venti on the caramel cloud, but I don't get the venti on the frappuccinos because that's just way too much for me. I can't drink all that. It's just so filling. So I just got grande for the frappuccinos. Boy, I went ahead and got the uh, s'mores frappuccino because it just came back last week or the week before. We love the s'mores frappuccino. It's been out before, but like I said, I can't. Usually grande is the most I can do because the venti is so big. It just fills me up way too much. So let me try it and see if it's just as good as it has been before. Mm, yeah, it's good. Yep. I like it. They got the chocolate. And they got the marshmallow cream on the top there. And like little graham crackers crunching them there. That's always really good. And then I got Brad's here. I'm going to go take that to him in just a second here when I go get my hair trimmed. Alright guys, this is the end of the vlog. End of this really exciting vlog this week. This week I really don't think there was much of the vlog at all. I know I said that the last time, but this week not much. But, you know, so it goes. Not really much to happen this week. Mm -hmm. just, it flew by as always. Felt like it just started five minutes ago and it's already over. Mm -hmm. So, back to work tomorrow. I won't be off for another five days. I went back to work today. Mm -hmm. You're off Sunday though, at least. Mm -hmm. I kind of hate it because my days off are Wednesday and Sunday. I don't like that. I'd rather have two days off together. Not split up. But there's not a way to really do it. So that's the way it is. Yeah. And Marco, he's still here. He hasn't been in the vlog. I told Brad, I said, Marco has not been in the vlog for like the last three vlogs because he's working all the time. And he's right now in the shower. I was going to go vlog him and say hi, and now he's in the shower, so I got to bed. <laughs> I can't tell him to wait for him to get the shower. Yeah. Maybe next vlog you'll see him. Maybe. I should have vlogged on the way, take him to work, so he would have been in the vlog for a second today, but I was rushing to get him to work, and I just didn't do it, so. Anyway, so thanks for watching. Please comment, thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you all in the next vlog. I don't even know if Ralphie was in this week's vlog. He wasn't? I thought he was. I can't remember. Uh -oh. Alright, well there's Phoebe. Say hi Phoebe. Say hi. You can see Phoebe. Say hi. I saw Peanut earlier looking at the bird out there, so if you saw her anyway, yeah, now the bird that won't quit knocking onto the uh, mm -hmm. window.
Brad said he heard this reflection. He sees this reflection, thinks it's another bird, so he runs to trying to get the other bird or something. Actually, one of the subscribers sent me that on Snapchat because I Snapchatted it, and one of the subscribers Snapchatted me what it meant when a bird does that. So what it means is it's a mate and it'll, it's protecting its territory and so it's trying to chase the other bird off but it's reflection and it won't stop doing that until it finds a mate and has babies with the mate. And it happens in the spring with cardinals, chickadees, and there was another one, but I can't remember the, what the other one was. Yeah. And I seen Oilers. How do you say that? Or or Oilers? The birds Oilers? I can't say it right. Anyways, I seen four of them out front in the tree. So you know what that means? I'm gonna have to get a feeder for them. I've never seen them around here before, around our house ever. And there was four of them out there, so I need to get a feeder for them. They're pretty. Ralphie was feeder, dead. Huh? Ralphie said, Dad, look at those pretty birds out there in that tree. And I looked out there and that's what they were this morning. Four of them. <laughs> it was cool. We better go because my neck's hurting here. I'm leaning up. Oh, there we go. Alright, so thanks for watching. Please comment, thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you on the next vlog. Good night. Good night, y'all.